welcome back to my channel today I am doing a haul for you I know I've done a lot of hauls but I just can't help picking up things in stores or just little bargains today is a mixed haul it's from B&M's body care Tesco's and sex and I believe cash generators um, I just had to look there just to make sure I'm, I'm calling everything out. Um, so instead of rambling on, I am going to get on with this video because there's a, a few bits I've got to show you and knowing me, I'll probably ramble about them. Okay, so I have like a body care bag full of stuff. Um, I'm just going to pull things out around there and I'll tell you where they're from because I've just like mixed everything up and it's just hard to like show you like just sorting out like that so from b &Ms, i got this colgate 360 optic white um vibrating toothbrush this was 2.99 i believe i've lost the receipt um i've lost the receipt to most of these things so if i get the price wrong i'm really sorry um but this was 2.99 um uh, I do have the Colgate Optic White Toothpaste and I thought I'd give this a go. I do believe, I think, I'm not too sure. But I think it's the one with like the white pen at the end. I'm not too sure. It might be just be the toothbrush. But I got this because I have the toothpaste and I thought it might help whiten my teeth a bit better because it has, um, it has like a bristle. It has a u unique head system to polish and shine. So it and has another like it's got like a bit on bit on the tough brush. Um, has like ego. It says yeah, vibrating tough brush with polishing polishing bristles and stain erasing caps. So it will help the stains go quicker and my teeth whiten quicker. So I really do like this. And this was two pound ninety nine from B and M's by the way. Um, I did buy this next item. Um, my mother actually bought it. Um, but it is a trolley coupon. Uh, well, trolley talking keyring, it says, but yeah. Um, these were two for 150. Obviously, she got herself one. She got a, she got the one exactly the same. Um, she got me this because we're always using our pound coins. And every time we go to a tail, it always comes to like, 23 pound and we always don't have a spare pound because it's in the trolley so now that we've got um one of these we it'll come in handy um something i have bought for my mum i bought it as a present for my mum that i don't have with me is the oh my god uh perfume set i will add a little clip in the video for you so that you can see the actual set yourself but it was 4 99 for the set and it is amazing and my mother really wanted it she saw it in the shop she's like oh i really wanted that uh, but i can't afford it and because i had money on me i thought i'd buy it for her for as a little present for like basically taking me and ryan in and looking after us seeming as i'm on the urge of b&m's i've like managed to pull the b&m things out this bag i don't know how um this bag has ripped just to let you know But I got, I actually got two boxes of these, but my boyfriend's, uh, like, lost one. Like, he's forgot it at his friend's. But I got two boxes of these. These were £1.50 each for each box. And this is for 10 individual, a no, individually wrapped Twinkies. He absolutely loves Twinkies. But every time I buy him, he goes, I am not going to eat those in one in case I get diabetes. I said, dry. Right, you can't say that because look it's a twinkie they're really sicky and you're not gonna want to eat them all in one because you'll be really um sick you'll feel really sick and by the way just because i said like you'll get diabetes i don't actually like i won't take in any like mick out of anyone that's got diabetes because my mother has diabetes and i know it's a real struggle because you're not meant to eat certain things but stuff like sh really sugary things like that can cause you to get diabetes that's why my boyfriend takes caution of what he eats but I did get two boxes of these. Um, obviously, I only have the one box because my boyfriend's left the other box with his friends. And they were one fifty each. I might as well do the last thing from B&M's. And it's this. It did come in a three pack, but I've drank three. Uh, three. Drank two. Um, and it's just these cans of milk. And honestly, guys, it doesn't taste like milk. It tastes like cream. 
like someone's just chucked um liquid cream in a carton that says milk on it um and basically yeah it just tastes like that it's like the cheapy cheapy milk you can get um but it's all right i just wanted some milk because um i felt a bit lightheaded and normally when i drink milk it makes me feel a bit better so we will go on to body care now because i've managed to get it all together first thing i've pulled out of the bag is this gillette satin care um advanced formula with the touch of ole violet swirl shave gel this is really heavy um this was 199 normally in other shops like will cause and that it's normally like two three pound so i did pick it up because i have run out of shaving gel and this is the only shaving gel i can use because it's like smooths my skin out and it doesn't make my skin like itchy or anything so i did purchase this next item i have is the nivea anti perspirant dry confident plus extra protection 48 hour um this has dry plus system and minerals um this smells amazing guys honestly um if i could show you there it is i have another one um i'm not too sure i think that's the extra soft one i'm not too sure um but i love nivea um deodorant because it just better for my skin and it doesn't have any alcohol in the nivea ones and that's what i really like um <clears throat> This cost me 99p, obviously, from the body care shop. Um, and I really, really like that. And it smells amazing. And my underarms are going to be amazing. And I've got this one ready for when I run up my, with my other one because I'm nearly done with my other one. So that I've got a backup so I don't run out and I like stocking up. Next thing in my bag is this Intense... I think that's what it's called. Intense Dry Shampoo in Blossom. Um, I got this for my handbag um, because sometimes um, I, when I go and see, well, basically go and pick up my boyfriend from his friends, I normally end up stopping down Ryan's friends for the night and then go home the next day and sometimes my hair gets greasy. So I thought if I pack this in my bag so that I've got it everywhere I go, if I feel like my hair's greasy... Um, end up sitting down someone's house and not being able to pack my stuff before i go at least then i've got this or if i'm in a rush like the morning and then i've got a i'm ahead and wash my hair the night before at least then i've got this um let's let's see what this smells like it smells of alcohol an alcoholic drink pina colada it smells of pina colada alcohol drink guys honestly um, but this one you get 50 mils free and this cost me 99p I think I've lost my receipt so I can't tell you oh wait what's this what's this it's the body care receipt I found it and um, so let's have a look um yes this cost me 99p um just let you know the body care shop bag cost me 49p I only bought it because it's small um, and I'm going to put it in my handbag because then when I ever go out shopping and I don't buy too many things, I've got, at least then I've got a little bag to put stuff in. Okay, next. Um, I have these Glade Scents and Spray um, refills. I have two of them. I have the cl Clean Linen because I love the smell of like fresh laundry and stuff. Um, and then I have this Relaxing Scent which is just like a really nice spa smelling scent. Um, I do have one of those um, sprays which senses movement. Um, I, my mother actually bought it for me, um, ready for when I have a flat. But I'm, I just started, I'm just using it now just to make the room smell nice. So I've just picked up some backup refills because mine's nearly running out as I had I have had it for about a month now. Um, so I just got these. These retailed at one ninety nine each which I think is a bit pricey for um, actual little refills. But it's Glade and it's a good brand, so I don't see what the problem is. But yeah, I just picked up these just for backups. Next two things I picked up um, are from the range Montage Janice. Um, these retailed at 89p each. Um, I've really started getting into face masks now. Um, and I've been really liking tea tree stuff. So when I saw these, um, I had to pick them up. 
Um, I really wanted to give them a go anyway. I seen them and I didn't know Montage Janice did the sheet ones. Um, but these are just the tea tree sheet mask. Um, so I got two of those just to try them out. And I'm really liking tea tree stuff at the moment. As you know, I do have a tea tree face wash, which actually costs the same price as one of these masks. Um, but I don't like using the like liquidy ones, like the ones that dry on your skin or the peel off ones. I absolutely hate them. So I've got some face masky ones, some like sheet ones. Um, and if I really do like these, then I'm going to get some more and stock up on them. So I got these and as I said, they were 89p each. Next in my bag, I have already started using because it's like a handbag goodie. Um, but I got this Charlie Pink. This is the only Charlie spray that I love um, at the whole Charlie range. I don't like any other one. Um, and because I've seen it in there, I was like, I'll pick it up for my handbag as I'm always needing a spray just to freshen myself up. And this was 99p. So next time I get paid, I'm going to stock up on these as well. Um, this just smells amazing. Oh, so, so nice. And as I said, I've already started using this because I needed to freshen myself up earlier. Um, and the smell was amazing. The Apparently to this, it says, yeah, try layering, layering Charlie Pink plus Charlie Electric Blue. So I might give that a go. Um... And I like these because they come with quotes on the side as well. This one comes with Dream Big and Don't Even Forget Your Lipstick, which I love. Um, so, and this scent is Vanilla and Tangerine. So that's a really nice scent. I normally don't like vanilla stuff, uh, like scents. So I'm glad I've got that one. And as I said, that was 99p. Then lastly from Body Care, I got these. Now I needed these because I have... Um, a pump uh what can how can i explain it like i have um what nail nail remover pump which pumps up the uh actual liquid but i didn't have any of these cotton wool pads so i just got a hundred for 95p um and these are colored these are pink ones um, so I'm just going to chuck these in my little nail box just so that I've got them ready for when I want to take my nail polish off. Um, I thought I'd get them from there because obviously they're pink um, and I thought they were unique because you don't really get pink ones. I don't like the colour pink, my favourite colour is actually purple. But I got these because these are the sort of soft and natural ones um, and they're 100% cotton. So I got those and as I said they were 95p. Okay so next I'm going to go on to Tesco's. Um, in my town, there is, well, in one of my towns, because there's an even this Port Talbot, um, there, there's the big Tesco shopping, where they do all the shopping and that, and the next door is the Tesco, it's just a separate shop, and it's called Tesco's Clearance Stock. That's where they have all their clothes, which they're getting rid of for cheap, and I needed to pick up Ryan's niece something for her birthday, because we didn't pick her anything up. And I said to her mummy that I would pick something up. Um, and to be honest, I think these are a bargain, especially for what they are. So the first thing I picked up is these beautiful, I wish I had a little girl to myself, guys, honestly, so I could put these on her. But I bought these beautiful, sparkly, glittery, silver um, leggings with little Princess Elsa on it. And it, she's standing with a snowflake behind her and it says queen of snow um these are cost me and these are the actual disney brand as well guys like it's not like any fake brand these cost me three pound fifty down from oh no sorry these went i just noticed that these went from seven pound down to three pound fifty down to two pound and I just thought that was really cute. And there's nothing wrong with them. Like, I've checked the whole pair before I bought them. There's nothing wrong with them. They're brand new. Um, obviously, I'm going to take the prices off them before I give them to the, her. But I thought that would look cute. And that's in the size 18 to 24 months, which I think is a bit big at the moment. Um, but she will get her wear out of them when it comes to it. And the last thing from Tesco's, I bought this beautiful 
Elsa and Anna dress. I wish they did this in my size, guys, because this is so beautiful. Um, so it has a long sleeve, long sleeves, and it's like got a skater skirt bottom, which I think is so cute. The only thing wrong with this is that a bit of the thread is coming off where the button is, which is perfectly fine because you can always sew the buttons back on. This is in the size nine to 12 months which will fit her the leg we got the leggings a bit bigger because she at least then she can grow into them but her mummy will probably match these with some white little uh, leggings or tight um and i just think that's really cute and this went from eight pounds down to five pounds which i think was a good bargain and as soon as i seen it i fell in love with it so i had to pick it up and i also thought that these would also go together so I have to send a picture to her mummy now just to let her know what I've bought her as her birthday has gone already anyway so it doesn't matter. Um, and then I can give them to her next time I see her. Okay next I went to Cast Generator. For some reason it says sex on the front but obviously this person that bought it before bought it from sex and then took it into Cast Generator and they just left the sticker on. But I bought two Wii games. Um mainly because my mother she has a wii and it's just stuck in the cupboard to be honest and it's not being used um we have a lot of games for it just nobody's playing it so i thought if i pick up two games that someone's gonna play then it'd be awesome um so i picked up the sims 2 castaway because i've always wanted to play this um yes guys i've never played this and it's been out for like years um so it just obviously it just look, looks like this um this cost me three ninety nine, which I thought wasn't too bad. Um, obviously, it's been used, but I don't care because I'm going to be playing it a lot. And then I bought this one for my brother because he's a big, big Marvel fan. And this is the Iron Man, the Ophicle video game. So I bought that for him. Um, and this cost one ninety nine, um, which I didn't think was too bad. Um, and the inside looks like this to this one. So I bought those two games from Cast Generator and I think that's a really good buy and I think I'm going to buy some more Wii games from there as well. Then lastly in this haul I went to Sex. I think that's how you spell it. Well that's how I say it. It's C-E-X or uh, uh, that's how I say it anyway so sorry if I'm saying it wrong. And I've got three DVDs. Um... One of them I've been wanting for ages. Um, I've seen all these movies now. And these like, are the newest movies that came out la last year. Um, and I've seen all these movies and I'm in love. Firstly, I'm going to get off... Well, show you the one that I'm obsessed with. Only because it has Channel Tatum in and I'm obsessed with Channel Tatum. And it is Magic Mike XXL. Guys, just look at him. He is perfect. Um, but yeah, I got this. It's cost me... Five pound, which I think was a bargain. Seeing as in the shops, it's like ten, eleven pound. Um, I can't wait to rewatch this when my boyfriend comes home. Um, so then I can actually say, to be honest, I prefer this one over the first one. I do have the first one, and um, that's the only reason why I bought this one as well, mainly because I like it, and because I've got the first one, so that I've got this one to go with the first one now. Um, so I got that. The next one I got is Minions because I'm ad I'm addicted to Minions. This one also cost five pound, um, and this includes three new mini movies on it as well, which I think is good. I've actually seen this, and the film the film's alright. It's funny, but it's somewhat more for kids to sit down and watch. Obviously, I'd watch it because I'm a big kid myself, but I mainly watch it for Bob because he is so so cute. He's my favourite Minion. And this is what the inside of this one looks like. I didn't show you what the inside of Magic Mike looks like. <sighs> That's what Magic Mike looks like. Then the last one I seen with a old friend of mine um, in cinema. And honestly, guys, it broke my heart watching it. Um, but I got it so it can go in my collection and I can watch it. Um, seeing as I have Love Rosie on DVD, I was like... 
I've seen that one and said I need to get the other one. And that's the best of me. I've been wanting this for ages. This one was really cheap, in fact. This one was £3.50, guys. And this in Tesco's is £10. So I'm so glad I got a bargain. I absolutely love this. Um, this is what the front, the front, the inside looks like. Um, this is an absolutely amazing movie, guys. It is very sad. But honestly, it's the best movie ever. I'm going to be lending these DVDs to my mum. Because she hasn't seen any of these. And I've recommended her to watch every single one. Because they're so good. But these are going to look amazing in my collection. Um, you haven't seen my collection, honestly, guys. It's mad. Half of them are my DVDs that I bought. Half of them are my boyfriend's. Um, but these ones are part of my collection as I bought them. And I just can't wait to watch Magic Mike. Okay, guys, that's everything in my collection. I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you're new to my channel, then hello. Please click the subscribe button. I'd love you to be part of my journey on my YouTube channel. If you are a regular subscriber, please give this video a big thumbs up. And I shall see you in my next video, guys. Bye.